somewhere that we've been to before. Welcome, boys and girls. It's me, Safety Sue. Do you remember me? Oh, yeah. 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 yeah! yeah! You have been brought here on a mission to become the new Street Smart Heroes. Did she say? She did, Street Smart Heroes. Um, am I dreaming? I don't think so. Well, okay, then I'm not dreaming. Safety Sue, are you sure we can be the next Street Smart Heroes? Cool. I can be a superhero! And, and we, we can, can be super superheroes too! Hold on. This isn't going to be as easy as you might be thinking. To become the next Street Smart Heroes, you have to go to a historical place with lots of colorful decorations. Sounds cool. Where is this place? Well, that I cannot tell you. But you will have to solve many quests and puzzles to get there. And I will be giving you hints all along the way. Will there be anyone helping us? Yes, of course. Look, these are my safety assistants. Hello! 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 <laughs> so, children, let me introduce you to our superheroes. First, we have Jake. He's 10 years old and loves ice cream, reading, and poetry. He's a dreamer, but he's also a talented poet. Roses uh, are... Not now. Maybe later. Next superhero is Nina. She's 12 years old. She's alert and can spot any possible danger. Phew, thanks. As you can see, she's always well prepared for any eventuality that can possibly happen. This is her superpower. Thanks. The next boy is Ben. Ben! He's 14 years old. You're not 14 years old. <laughs> Anyways, he's a happy-go-lucky kind of guy. He's free from worry and stress, and he's always ready to crack us up with one of his jokes. This is his superpower. Okay, what screen I was about to hit? The bicycle! No, this apple! <laughs> and finally, this is Emma. She's eight years old and she remembers everything, knows everything, and can do anything. Did you know that Valletta has a total of 28 churches? The oldest church was built. Okay, okay. The only problem with this girl is if you don't stop her, she'll go on forever. But I'm pretty sure that her knowledge will come in handy later on. It's time to begin our journey. Are you all ready? Yes! 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 And are you children ready as well? That's the spirit. But before we start off our journey, let's kick it off by singing our road safety song all together. Traffic signs and be safe on the road Hold at it. all times. begin your journey? Yes! Then, let's begin. For your first quest, you have to walk straight ahead until you find this sign. Go! Lost. 
and people start to believe we were taken by a ghost. Friends, don't leave my side. Please remain close. And watch me while I take my dramatic pose. Wait, according to my GPS, we're nearly there. Approximately in one minute, 36 seconds. And, to be precise, 15 milliseconds. Let's hurry up. Follow me. That didn't take you long. Now, what is the name of this sign? Safety assistants, you have 60 seconds to help them out. Remember, if you get this right, they can move on to their next quest. I need an answer in five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. You're right, it is a zebra crossing sign. I've read a lot about the zebra crossing sign. According to my research, a zebra crossing sign is a pedestrian crossing marked with white stripes at which vehicles must stop to allow people to cross the road. Before crossing, it's important to allow enough time for drivers to see you so they can stop. You also have to look in both directions and keep on looking as well as listening in case a vehicle attempts to overtake another vehicle that has stopped. Oh, 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 I have a good one for you. Why did the donkey not cross the road? Because um, uh, he saw what happened to the zebra. <laughs> <laughs> well done for successfully completing your first quest. Now, this time, you have to find this sign. Go! Wait, I happen to have a lot of shapes in my bag. to impress you, that shape is a circle. Wait, the sign has arrows pointing in a clockwise direction, forming a circle, just like this shape. Yeah, that's what I said. Safety assistance, am I right? Okay, let's all look for something circular. Thanks, safety assistance. This means we're very close to the sign. This must be the circular intersection that the sign's referring to. Let's walk until we find the sign. Look, there are two signs here. Safety assistance, help us out. Which one of these two signs? is similar to this shape. Is it this sign? Or is it this sign? Safety assistance, you have 30 seconds to make your choice. I need an answer in five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. Okay, safety assistants, let's turn around and see if you're right. Hey, this is a match. We found it. Have
Have we completed our quest? Yes, you are on the right track. Well done. Now, safety assistance, you have 30 seconds to tell me the name of the sign. Go! I need your answer in five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. It is indeed a roundabout sign. Oh no, Ben is feeling unwell. Doing? I was obeying the sign and going round and round and round. That sign isn't for pedestrians, Ben. It's for drivers. Oh, that's why I'm dizzy then. According to my research, a roundabout is a type of junction where road traffic flows clockwise around the central junction with priority normally given to those already on the roundabout and those approaching it on your right. They are designed to keep the traffic flowing safely without the need for traffic lights. Always make sure to use the mirrors and signal as you approach a roundabout and to adapt your position and speed accordingly. You will also need to check the appropriate mirrors, use the correct indicator and move into the correct position in relation to the exit you plan to take. I've been trying to figure out roundabouts for a long time. It just felt like I'm going in circles. We are now moving on to our next quest. Are you excited? Yes! yes! The more quests we have, the closer we are to being the next Street Smart Hero. That's right. Now, it's time for you to find the symbol. Follow me! Wait! According to my compass, we have to head east. Look, there it is. How are we going to get there? Crossing the road outside of the zebra crossing area is not a safe option. I've got this. I'll get us there without the need to cross the road in the first place. Whoa, this was so cool. Can we do it again? Well, you can, but if someone doesn't have superpowers like we do, they can just use the zebra crossing. Well done, you've made it. Now, you have 60 seconds to tell me the name of this sign. Go! I need your answer in five, four, three, two, one. That's right, it is a no right turn sign. Yay! Ben, what are you doing? Well, since the sign is no right turn, I'm turning left. <laughs> 